Leona. Uh, I'm old enough to give myself my own tongue bath anyhow. No, oh, you can't do your own back. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. This would be a good time to read our tongue bath time story for today, huh? Yeah. <laughs> now, it's loosely based on a very old tale from India. It is called The Dirty Smelly King by Sir Hackney Mackinac. There once was a king, a dirty smelly king, a king named King Zack of Hackensack. Zack? Of Hackensack? Oh, I uh, said loosely based. <laughs> Very loosely based. <laughs> King Zack of Hackensack was so dirty and smelly, he was not very popular. And that's a fact. Oh, what a stink pot! Hey, you! King Zack of Hackensack asked his prime minister, Sir Jack of Nyack, why he was so unpopular. Is my crown on backwards? Is my jacket tacky? What is it, Jack? Sir Jack told King Zack that it might help if he took a bath once in a while. Go jump in the lake, Zack. So dirty, smelly King Zack of Hackensack jumped in the lake and took a bath. When King Zack walked out of the lake, he was no longer dirty and smelly, and he was very popular. <laughs> King Zack of Hackensack is no longer dirty and smelly. He is clean and not smelly. Hooray for clean and not smelly, King Zack of Hackensack! Hooray for clean and not smelly, Leona of the library. I can't see. Oh. Then King Zack of Hackensack looked down and saw that he was standing in the mud and his feet were dirty. Hey, my feet are dirty. So. Back in the lake walked King Zack of Hackensack. But when he walked back out, his feet were dirty again. My feet are dirty again. So he went back in, and back out, back in, and back out. Back in, and back out, back in. And back out, and back in, 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 and back out, and back here. You may continue. <laughs> <laughs> Sir Jack told King Zack to relax. Everyone in the kingdom had dirty feet, so it was no problem. No problem. <laughs> yeah, but having dirty feet was a problem for King Zack. He thought he would be unpopular again if any part of his body was dirty. And then he got an idea. King Zack jumped on Sir Jack's back. From now on, I will ride piggyback on you, Jack. My feet will never touch the ground, so they won't get dirty. <laughs> this guy should cut down on these snacks. And King Zack rode piggyback all over the place on Sir Jack's back forever and ever the end. That can't be the end. 
Zack can't ride piggyback on Sir Jack forever and ever. He can so? Mm -hmm. Daddy? Mm, yes, Leona? Can I ride piggyback just like King Zack rode on Sir Jack's back? Well, your wish is my command. Oh, oh, oh. Right. Oh, 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 oh. Here we go! Wow. Yeah! <laughs> that isn't really the end of the story, is it, Mom? No, it isn't, Lionel. Ha <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> so, are you ready for your tongue bath now? Oh, or would you prefer to do it yourself, old timer? Well, I've been thinking about it. You can do it if you want to. I mean, I know it's important to you, Mom. <laughs> You're too kind. Ah. Ah. Oh, you're a good mom. Oops. Zack. Ah. And now, lovers of the vowels A, E, I, O, U, and sometimes Y, give it up for Martha Reader and the vowels. Singing the short A sound from their smash word, The Um People. Weary of all the rhinos sliding down her banister, unflappable little Monica Maxwell has packed them all into a gigantic travel sack. But wait a minute, what's this? Oh no, it's the evil un people. They're putting an un in front of the word packed. Monica's sack has become unpacked. Those dratted rhinos are loose again. But be not sad, little Monica. The heroic free people are here. Look, they've re-rounded up the dratted rhinos and re-packed them in Monica's travel sack. Thank you, Ree people. You're fabulous. Pack. Quack. Ack. Ack. Quack, 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 pack, ack, sack, smack. And now it's time for Quaint Word, Quaint Word. Dwayne here once again at Blending Fields, where two brave knights in armor will charge together at high speed and make a word. Competing today, we have Sir <laughs> And on your right, Sir Ack. Ack. Blend on, dude. This is Gawain saying, see you next time on Gawain's Word, Gawain's Word. And now, 24 names with a short A, A sound in them. Meet Annie, Annie's Granny Tammy, Danny, Danny's Nanny Pammy, Sandy, Sandy's Bassett Dash, and this is Brandy. Meet Nancy, Alexandra Cabot, Clancy, Alexandra's Rabbit, Shaq and Matt. What's your name? What's your name? Enjoy your little moment of fame. Orlando Jan, Fernando Fran, and Mia Ham. And all these names you'll find short A. It sounds like ah, that's that good day. Ah. Barnaby B. Busterfield III, Public Library Information Hand speaking. You must bring it back. Yes. All you need is a library card. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. Yes. That's free, too. You're welcome. 
Library information, I'm speaking. Oh, oh, long distance. Well, how may I help you? Oh, one moment, I'll just look that up. Oh, oh, here it is, here it is. The answer is to get to the other side. Oh, you're welcome, your majesty. Let's see now. Ooh, that's good. Whoa. Wow, look how high I am, Daddy. What of you? Ah, hello down there. Yoo-hoo. <laughs> hey, Lionel. <laughs> Race it in the balcony, okay? All right, Leona, my dear. Charge! Oh, excuse me, sir. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> Time for soccer practice! Ooh. Yay, soccer practice! Yay! Yeah. Wow. <laughs> you can't play soccer from up there. Come on, Mom! Oh, yeah, yeah, but um, I, I, I... Yeah. Oh, come on, Daddy. Let's go play soccer. Come on, come on, come oh, on. Oh, I'm sorry, Leona. I can't. I have to stay here and, and take care of the library. Oh, yeah. You know, if you want to go, uh, I could put you down. No, 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 Daddy, no. I, I, I said I was going to stay up here forever and ever, and I, I'm going to stay up here forever and ever. Yeah. Well, okay, great. Well, then let's get to work. Oh, let's, yeah. Oh, there's let's my stamp. Get to work. Let's see. Uh... Back. Back. Lack. Eh. Lick. Lit. Lit. Ooh. Aunt. Light. <gasps> the monkey pop up theater. What? What is it that has given you such a fright? Oh, Dwight, it's night, and that gives me fright. At night, there's no light to brighten up my sight. So, Dwight, if it's all right, please give me a night light. But there's no need for fright, because... There's no need to light a night light on a light night like tonight. For a night light lights a slight light, and tonight's a night that's bright. 
No frights in sight, no sights of fright, and the light at this sight's quite bright. And so there's no need to light a nightlight quite slight on a quite, quite bright nightlight tonight. Yes, yes quite, yes, yes quite, quite, hold tight, hold tight, because now we've got it right. And there's no need to light a nightlight on a light night like tonight. Lights, lights, a, a night, light, 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 and tonight's the light, light, light that's tonight bright. No frights in sight, no sights of fright, and tonight's lights that's light, it's quite bright and quite bright, so we no need to light a night light tonight, cause tonight's a light night that's bright. Flapjack. <laughs> now twist your tongue around this one. Snap, 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 Strap snapped. Snap 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 the fabulous Vowels and the magnificent Johnny Consonanti come together on our stage in an earth-shattering performance of that smash hit word at... And now, fun with Chicken Jane. Today, Chicken Jane and the Fat Cat. Look, look, see, see, coming down the lane. Here comes Scott, here comes Dot, here comes Chicken Jane. Look, Scott, look at that. I see a cat. Yes, Dot, I see the cat. The cat is fat. Look, Scott, look. That fat cat is an acrobat. Look, Dot, look. See Chicken Jane write the letters S-C-A-T. Cat, scat, scat. Scat, scat, scat. Scat, Dot, scat. Look at that. The fat cat went splat. 
Chicken Jane is flat. Yes, Chicken Jane is flat. We are not flat. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, Chicken Jane. And now a word from world-renowned mezzo-soprano, Miss Denise Graves. That. Oh, 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 oh that, that was, was oh, amazing. Oh, oh, oh. You were all dragged in a bag of chips. Oh, you know, did you hear that? I heard that. Oh, that, that was, was so amazing. That was incredible. Oh, 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 I love that. Oh, I just that love that. That. Then, eh, then, hen, w, when. All right, let's find out who's who. Here. Who's here? Yes. What? Here. Who are you? No, I'm what? You're who? No, I'm who. Where? Here. Where are you? Yes. What? That's me. You're who? No, I'm what? He's who. Where? I'm where? He's what? And I'm who? <sighs> why me? No, why me? I'm why. <laughs> All right. So you're why, mm -hmm. you're who, Yep. you're where, Yeah. and you're what? Right. right. Fine. Now, when... <laughs> what? No, I'm what? <sighs> <laughs> <laughs> Zach. Guys, guys, I'm over here, I'm over here, I'm over here. Yeah! Whoa! I want to put some pressure on that, you know? W. Uh, w. Dad, w. Can we go play soccer now, please? Oh, I'm sorry, Leona. I can't right now. I've got to stay here in case somebody needs something. Uh, w. 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 Oh. I wonder how King Zach likes staying up on Sir Jack's back forever and ever. Oh, well, why don't we read uh, the rest of the Dirty Smelly King and find out? Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, let's do that. Let's... King Zach of Hackensack decided to ride piggyback on his Prime Minister, Sir Jack of Nyack, forever and ever. Like me. And then one day... King Zach and Sir Jack decided to play a game of Kick the Sack. But King Zack was not having fun playing kick the sack. I, I never got to kick the sack. This is no fun, Jack. <laughs> Tell me about it. <laughs> King Zack couldn't kick the sack as long as he was on Sir Jack's back. Huh? But if he got off Sir Jack's huh? back, his feet would huh? get black. Huh? Alack, alack, poor King Zack. Wait a minute, I, I just thought of something. Yeah? Shoes! Ah. Why didn't he just put shoes on his feet? Good thinking, Leona, mm -hmm. but shoes hadn't been invented yet. Oh, well, he has an excuse then. And just then, a man named Mac invented shoes and gave them to King Zack. King Zack got off Sir Jack's back and played kick the sack. But... King Zack's feet still got dirty. How come he wasn't wearing his shoes? Uh, huh? Are you crazy? They're brand new. I don't want to ruin them. <laughs> the end. <laughs> Final shoots, he scores! Daddy. Oh, yes, Leona, my little cublet. Uh, I, I don't think I want to be carried around on your back forever and ever. Oh, <laughs> uh, are you sure? Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure. <laughs> Here you go. <laughs> yeah, he does it. <laughs> <laughs> but, 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 Dad, but I, I can still ride, ride on your back sometimes, can I? Oh, Leona, you can ride on my back anytime you want to. Oh, thanks, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy, oh, boy, Leona, shoot these guys, oh, boy. Bye, no. Mom. Uh, oh, boy, oh, boy. Uh, bye, Leona. <sighs> One day it's piggyback, the next it's halfback. 
Oh, my little lioness is growing up fast. <laughs> Are you all right, Theo? <laughs> yeah, I'm fine. I'm just fine. <laughs> <sighs> Ah, finally, the silliness is over. All oh, that piggyback business is strictly for the birds. Yeah! <laughs> piggyback! Piggyback! Yeah. piggyback! That's not what I meant! <laughs> there are games and stories at the Between the Lions website, pbskids.org, or America Online. Keyword, PBS Kids. Reading to children every day creates warm family memories, and it helps them become better readers. Help a child get wild about reading. Be a designated reader. Okay, Mom. <laughs> <laughs> Do your designated reader thing. Oh, 